So number one then from paper two of the 2018 National Five Maths. There's that expected question there. The percentage increase or decrease regularly over a number of years. Now, I bet nobody's going to do that the long way anymore by finding 2% and taking it off and then finding 2% in the new volume taken off, etc. It's a quick three marks. Households produce 1,250 tonnes of waste in 2017. If it falls by 2% a year, how much waste would be expected in 2020? Well, if it falls by 2%, it means it's down to 98% of the previous year. So the amount you'd expect would be 1,000, sorry, 125,000, 98% written as a decimal, over 100 divided by 100, is 0 0.98. And if that's going to happen three times, because there's three years there, it's the power three. You just put that in your calculator and that'll be your answer. And you get 117649. Then you think, round it off appropriately. That's to three figures. It doesn't say in the question about rounding it off. So I'll take it to 118000 tons. Number two then, there we go, slice of a circle. As soon as you see that picture, you know it's fractions, fractions of a circle. The diagram shows a circle centre, C, in. the radius is 7.4, what's the length of the major arc? That's the big one, well that's the angle you're given anyway. Well it's just fractions, isn't it? Whatever fraction arc AB is of the total arc, which is the circumference, I'll put that down as pi d, that's the same fraction that the angle is, which is 320, out of the total angle, 360. So what you've got to do is put that across. So arc AB is going to be 320, you could have cancelled it down, at least knocked off the zeros, but you're using your calculator, let it do the donkey work, times pi D, times pi times, now you can either put 2 times 7.4, or you can take time somewhere to write this, R equals 7.4, which means D is 2 times 7.4. I would just put 2 times 7.4 there. I prefer the old days when you had circumference, you just put 2 by R. Uh, 2 times that, which is 14.8. That was all a bit of a waste of time, really. Now you just use a calculator. Fraction button, very handy. And you get... 41.329 and so on, which I'll round off to 41.3 centimetres. Because if you'd used 3.14 there, you'd have put a slightly smaller answer in this part, but it would still round off to the same thing.